welcome back to my channel and if you are new welcome my channel is about handbag slg and jewelry reviews regardless of brand or price as i personally love items that are well made good quality and value for money today i have with me uh, this handbag fula crossbody 1927 crossbody they put it 1927 perhaps this is inspired uh, in the year 1927 this is a uh, and it's just a flat back, it's like with croc embossed. This is the croc embossed. Sorry about the chain, that is so noisy. Then, without further ado, let me start with the size I have here. This size for this, the width of this handbag, which is from this end to this end, the width is 23 cm. The height from here to here is 15 cm. The, the, the depth of it, which is the side here, is the, the depth of it which is this is 9 cm but as it goes up it will be smaller and the strap for this the this is the this is this strap uh, is not strap is not removable it's not adjustable as well um, but they have cross body as well as shoulder let me show you the shoulder strap for this the shoulder strap for this is uh, from this end to this end to this from this end to this end is 29 cm and the longest strap for this uh, cross body, the longest cross body strap, uh, as you can see the longest cross body strap from this end to this end is um, 53 cm. So I can carry it both ways. I can use it, so I can use it um, shoulder this way, or I can actually uh, cross body if I want to. I can use it as cross body if I want to as well. So. This is the twist lock Fula uh, handbag. Uh, I believe uh, this is quite new. Um, it's made in Italy and uh, they have one back pocket here. I can actually put in uh, small tin cards and tin cards or even car park uh, uh, tickets. Okay, let me show you actually uh, what fits inside. I have all the things inside me. Let me show you what I, I fit inside. I have, I have, um, okay, I have put my, uh, okay, this is my sun ref, uh, this I have put inside my sun ref card, wave card case. Um, uh, I have also put in the car key, my car key, then uh, phone, of course, the cover. I'm using my phone to do a video. This is my mask, this is my mask, and uh, of course, um, the tissue paper, the wet tissue paper, and one hand sanitizer. So uh, this is all that I can fit in. I can also uh, uh and one lippy uh, and one lippy here. I have a one lippy here. This lippy, I love this lippy. This is very nice. This is uh ST Lauder, uh, but it's uh quite red. Um, that I love it so much. This. Yeah. So this is all that can fit in. You can see here as for the reference. Uh, I wouldn't say it's very big, but uh, it it can fit all the essentials. And this is the mid. This size is uh exactly uh, almost the same as Chanel small classic. I have checked that out. The size is almost the same. Uh, however, the difference is here. Uh, Chanel one is uh, smaller here. Side of it on the depth side of it is smaller. Chanel one is six point is six point six cm something like that. It's two point six inch something like that. This is nine. This is nine here. So and uh, this is quite boxy. It is uh, you can see is the shape is quite boxy. I the reason I actually got this as well is also to try out uh, the flat back about the flat back because I don't really have a flat back in my collection. Uh, before I actually embark into Chanel uh, flat back. So Chanel flat back classic flat back. Um, all of it have uh, double flap, but uh, this is just a single flap. Uh, but it, it kind of a good feel to actually uh, try out the flat bag before I actually embark into it because um, as we all know Chanel flat bag is the price keep going up and I want to also uh, see whether uh, the flat bag that they have in Chanel be it medium or small suits my lifestyle so um so this is one of the flat bag I know it's very boxy compared to Chanel which is not so but uh, it's still a good, it's still a good 
example to 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 try on and and the price is so much different obviously Fula is so much different and this price that I got for this is actually um I got it at a discount actually I got it from Farfetch at 340 US dollar plus delivery plus tax and everything which is a very good buy for a full leather I have showed you what fits inside just now so let me talk about the pro and the cons for this handbag this handbag is very versatile uh, it can be used for day and night transition which is very easy uh, since it's not a very big bag uh, it, from, it is a uh, very classic design this one is very classic design the transition is very easy from from a day bag to a night bag um, that is quite formal as well and the chain the, the chain is very uh, substantial day bag to a night bag so this is very versatile for me so i like it so and uh, this look and this, this is a very so a very classic classic uh, handbag i would say this is a very classic handbag but more if it is with crop embossed and this has elevated the handbag look uh, of any handbag actually with crop embossed it has a very elegant look on it so it's a time and timeless piece and so therefore I got this crop embossed on it it's slightly more expensive than the usual one but I don't mind since uh, this I like this design so much so, um, and this look and this design is uh, I like this design as well. This is also very a uh, clean design. You can see this handbag is a very clean design, and the side is a very simple and clean design look. As you can see, this this is a very simple and clean design look. And also the logo is um, if you are not into Fula or what you may not know. So the, although they just have this Fula Italy, you can see here, Fula Fula Italy. So uh, yeah, you can see here Fula. Uh, it's not onto your face type uh, those people who not, they may not know as well so I love this one so um, this feature of it and um, and also the as I said the, the this strap can be it can be worn a few ways this can be worn as a crossbody if you wear it like that it's a crossbody or if you do not want you can do it as a shoulder shoulder uh, handbag as well double up as a shoulder handbag as well uh, this one uh, it fits all your essentials but uh, it's not as big as uh, if you want to fit more in there so and the price is very reasonable for this full leather uh, so, um, and it, the shape and since this is a very boxy shape uh, you can see this is a very boxy handbag um, you are not really I'm not really afraid of uh, our shape in years to come uh, although I have an organizer inside, uh, just a very flimsy one to actually protect the interior inside. I have the organizer to protect the interior inside, which is the beige color, you can see. Uh, but then it's uh, kind of like uh, just to protect the interior. It's, I'm so sorry that I forgot to mention, actually inside there has an interior zip pocket here, which I don't think I will use it, interior zip pocket here. And uh, alright, the side here, they don't have anything. Uh, yeah, they have another interior pocket here as well. They have another interior pocket here. Uh, this interior pocket here and also one zip compartment in, uh, inside. One is a uh, zip compartment and one interior pocket which I hardly use. So this, um, I just put everything in the middle. It's easier for me to have see, uh, just get whatever I want from there. So the cons, let me tell you the cons of this handbag. It's a very boxy, this is a very boxy handbag. If you do not like a boxy handbag, you like a slouchy handbag, this is, may not be for you. This is a very boxy handbag. You can see this here is a very boxy handbag. So this is not a slouchy handbag. But um, it can only fit all the, and the other thing is it can only fit all the essentials. Uh, if you want to carry more than what I have showed you, uh, I'm afraid that you can't put in. So down, you have to downsize. Uh, you can't carry a full size wallet if you want to carry a full size wallet uh you can but then again there's not not much room left i would say yeah there, there isn't much room left you want to put a full size wallet which uh is no point i can show you i have this um this coach this coach full size wallet you can fit in if you want to you can fit in but it take up more for most of the space 
you can see invite you can take up most of the space for this for this handbag so um when you use this handbag it, it is no point putting a full size continental wallet thing like that it's very big you can use just a card holder and even uh, this uh, some ref wave card case this will be good enough this one where you can put as i have a video on this you can put your cash and your card here which is good enough so or even a slim the slimmest card holder those are very slim type i don't have that but uh, this is good enough for me so um, to get to put in this put, to put into this handbag and this brand is uh, quite new and this to some a lot of people this brand is a contemporary brand but to me i still love it um regardless of the, pr the price or the brand as long as uh, i find it uh, suit my lifestyle and very versatile i love it so much and this is as i said if this is a contemporary brand um anyway uh, uh apart from chanel lv and hermes uh, the resale value for other brands uh, may not be good so uh, what you want to do is you buy uh, the handbag you purchase the handbag you enjoy it that's all not resell it and all these things so they wouldn't have a very good resale value for this this could be a con for some but for me uh, i don't see myself uh, wanting to sell any of this handbag or what i i just want to use it and enjoy it so opinion for this uh this this, if you want to start your collection or start a basic collection for your handbag or a curated collection, limited uh, budget, um, you can choose this. I will recommend this. It's very, and, uh, this brand is also uh, quite well known. So this is so good actually. So uh, if you want to start your collection or you want to go uh, a simple uh, handbag route not chanel brand or lv or hermes uh, just want to uh, have a curated and nice elegant look this could be one of your uh, one of your handbag you can start off with i do recommend actually i love this handbag very much and i did use it quite a few times although not a lot of times because since last year pandemic till now so this is still a leather handbag but I did use it a few times and I do enjoy it very much. So um, and 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 also I said that as I mentioned that I had I like this design because it's cloth embossed design. It's very classic and ele elevates the look of any outfit. Overall, uh, I would I do recommend this handbag. Uh, if you were to ask me, I hope this video will help you. And if you love all this video, do remember to subscribe. Click, click on the notification button and also the subscribe button below so that you will be notified each time I upload a new video. And I'll see you then. Take care everyone and have a good day. Bye.